game slash hold the door to life diversion change diversion bro diversion Oh, I'll be damned. I've been sitting here bullshitting so, the whole time. Is it all true? What have you heard already? That illness. It thickened the bones. It accelerated the healing process and tissue regeneration. Is that all true? Every word. But if that's what it was doing, why call it an illness? The Lepidopterans made a nest out of the human body, where they could eat and multiply. An illness is what it is. But then? Where do you want me to start? From the beginning. <sighs> I'm old, Mr. Manny. My memory is not one of my strong points. Well, for example, why do they call you Madame Svenska? The name is just a trace. It is our business card, our identifier. It presents us to the world. But does it tell our story or really describe who we are? Hello. I swear I know three or four idiots with the same exact name. <laughs> well, yes. But we are not made of that name. It is given to us. Other people choose it for us, whether it suits us or not. It doesn't. Testing. Okay, we're cool. I'm gonna turn the uh the light out to get more into the feel of this. Probably can't see me, but that's okay. You can so, when this comes up. Is it all true? What have you heard already? That illness, it thickened the bones, it accelerated the healing process and tissue regeneration. Is that all true? Is that all true? Every word. But if that's what it was doing, why call it an illness? The Lepidopterans made a nest out of the human body where they could eat and multiply. An illness is what it is. But then? Where do you want me to start? From the beginning. <sighs> I'm old, Mr. Manny. My memory is not one of my strong points. Well, for example, why do they call you Madame Svenska? A name is just a trace. 
It is our business card, our identifier. It presents us to the world. But does it tell our story or really describe who we are? I swear I know three or four idiots with the same exact name. <laughs> well, yes. But we are not made of that name. It is given to us. Other people choose it for us, whether it suits us or not. It doesn't tell us who we really are. That name will not give us any answers. It is only through growing old that we become the answer to the questions of our childhood. And living in Sweden the last 30 years has definitely inspired this affectionate moniker. And so, Madam Svenska, it is. And yet you come back to Italy. Why? Because I forgot. But I also forgot that I had promised to remember. Tell me. Please excuse me. Sometimes my memory needs to be jogged. There's always been a song that as well as the name you refer to so much, has labeled my whole life, has given it a name, and it's from a name. If you can believe how bizarre and sometimes unbelievable my confused memories are to describe that all this began. Like it's gonna rain again. I cannot do it now. There we go. So I've already played this, but, um...
How the fuck am I supposed to get in here? Maybe it's all down here. Is she gonna go over there? Relax, Barbara. Alright, this is where it gets serious. So how am I supposed to get in here, though? Can I just fucking... Excuse me. Knock, 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 motherfuckers. Did I do something wrong? Oh! I was supposed to go this way, hell. It's that bitch that was uh, missing that one time. Where should he splash? I was taking a bath. Oh, it's so anxious when looking at some icons. Icons and mirrors. Same. Is that a flower? Let me pick it. Yes, hello. I'm Dr. Reed from the Santa Margarita Institute. I'm sorry, but Mr. Felton is no longer a patient. I know. This is why I'm here. Hello? Uh, anyone? I think I'll just go ahead and go in. So, uh, my problem last time that I played this was that I, uh, I couldn't find a way out of the damn house and that old man was chasing me. I hope you, I hope I didn't spoil anything. If I did, then I'm sorry. This is my favorite part about this game. She's fine. Alright. Let's get to the business of the game. Excuse me. Knock it a knock 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 it. Hello? The gate was open. Are you there? Hello? Is anyone there? Oh, it's not. So what? Am I gonna like sneak in or something? This is, this just goes to tell you like uh, how long it's been since I've played. Like I played this right around the time I got my head injury, and then um, and then I couldn't play it because it was raising my anxiety, and it was harder to use my hands. Oh, I know where I gotta go. Alright, you need to stop, like, breathing like that, for real.
That's a trapey ass cow, it almost said. <sighs> the trapey ass cow. Good evening, Miss I am... Reed, you already told me at the intercom, and as I already told you, Mr. Felton is no longer a patient at the Center of the I Institute. Know. I came God, here voluntarily, so outside the Institute. So what do you want? I am personally re-examining your case. Causes, reagents... I strongly believe there are alternative ways and probably other experiments that are worth a try. I am fighting with the Institute to recognize there are other adequate remedies for your husband's oh, pathology. Oh, no, please. I I'm just assisting him. I'm his nurse. Uh, <laughs> I didn't know. Uh, it's okay. I suppose you want to talk to him. Thank you. I apologize for the darkness, but Mr. Felton's sight has been damaged and immensely compromised because of the disease. He's so rude. He's walking anyway, out of there and everything. I am Gloria. Oh, and please, refrain from smoking inside. Mr. Falcon hates the smell of smoke. Sorry. I have had no water today. Sorry, I also had to, uh, make some weird noises with my mouth because my mucus is acting up. I'm sure that you didn't want to hear that. walk I guess please this way Roger that bad habit smoking yes such a shame you should quit you have What's no idea how bad this is for you not only for your health but it's also very expensive money and time wasted I have so much to do every day I couldn't waste time with such a bad habit do you assist mr. Felton all day Oh no, from midday to 8 p.m. Then I go back home. I live near here. If needed, he can contact me with a pager, but that's not often. His wife takes care of him when I'm off. What can you tell me about her? I met her just a couple of times. Okay. She's no, I need to pay attention to where I'm going. Bedroom when I'm here. So, say they don't this direction is long. the door. So I need to go out of there. I thought I came down here, though. So, excuse me, man, I'm leaving. Oh, it's going to make me follow her? Ah, oh, shit, okay. I need to remember where this door is, because I will surely forget. I didn't know. But, you know, when she's home, she listens to the same music, the same song, over and over. Hold on. Settings. What's the... I forgot how to, um... The hell's... I don't know what that is. I'll go 90 though, I guess. Tutorial on, yes. Oh, vibration, walk, run, crouch. What's dodge? B. Okay. I'm going to be doing a lot of that probably.
All right, fine, I'll come. Okay, so I need to go down that one. Why did that scare me? What the hell? This way, please. And Mr. Felton will be here in a few minutes. Roger okay. that. R R Roger that. My little Wayne. some stuff over here. Can I run? I can't run. Shit. Alright, so I gotta remember what damn door I came through. I mean, I don't really want to go through his shit, but, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go through his shit. Mr. and Mrs. Farton's F Farton. <laughs> well, that's their new name now. Mr. and Mrs. Farton Farm, Rosso Galino, closes. Danger of contamination. I'm not going to read all this to y'all. Y'all can just read it. So he found out, uh, he got a medicine or whatever, and, um, oh shit, there's a letter. Hmm. That's a portrait of myself. believe in God, miss? Well, That's an odd question to just come out and ask easy, me, but... Wouldn't it? Okay. I believe in people's willpower. Everything else is not God, but an aptitude or mankind's cruelty. This is the kind of fairy tale I prefer at my age. When you're worn out from an incurable disease, you start having some doubts. Why is there so much life in such small but lethal creatures? An arbiter. That's all we need. For what? It's wrong and crazy. It's human nature. That same nature in which we are equals to those ants eating each other. But, pardon me, I forgot my manners. Please, sit down. Dr. Reed, I suppose? Uh, sorry, Mr. Felton. Pleased to meet you. So, you already met Gloria? Yes, she let me in. She's a great reference, extremely hardworking, but back to us. I don't recall seeing beautiful doctors like you at the Institute, Dr. Reed. I am flattered, Mr. Felton. I arrived at the Institute just a few...
a few months after you left. And you left because... Inadequacy of the sanitary treatments within the structure. That's right. And in a few words? In a few words. They didn't know how to treat my case, and they left me there to die. But it seems that other issues took over. I once or twice refused to go through exams. Mr. Felton, is there anything I can do for you? Oh, Gloria, yes. See if Dr. Reed needs anything. Oh, no. May I offer you a cup of tea or coffee? Espresso? No, thank you. As you wish. How about you, Mr. Felton? No, thank you. I'll keep entertaining our guest. You can go now. You're diagnosed? 1958? Yes, indicatively. Some friends and I contracted the disease while traveling to Egypt, and it got worse. In addition to the disease, the first exam showed some inconsistency. Some hormonal deficiency? Overdose of non-prescribed drugs? Opiates? Anoxal? Wasn't it recalled in the mid-60s? Doctor, don't you think that nowadays there are ways to obtain drugs without any prescription? Uh, I believe so. According to your file, you still receive your disability pension. Even better, it seems that the beneficiary is your wife, Ariana Gallo. Exactly. She's the Ariana one who takes Grande? care of me when Gloria is off. How about your daughter? My daughter? Celeste's never come back home. Disappeared. She was adopted, am I right? Mm. The investigators confirmed that she intentionally left. They never suspected a kidnapping since there was no ransom request. How about Weeman? Wasn't he a suspect? A flash in the pan, an idiot who brought confusion by sending warnings and threats. And her birth parents? Dr. Reed, young girls often decide to just go. And this is what my daughter decided to do with... Jennifer. What did you say? At times, you'd call her Jennifer. No, my Mr. daughter... Mr. Felton, what has really happened to your daughter? I just told you! How about the off-the-record version? I am not sure where you're trying to go with this, but I won't tolerate... I don't have the strength for this now! I know you've been trying to forget her, but this picture might help you to. What is this? Where did you get this picture? Isn't she your daughter? Celeste, or has you called her? Jennifer? I asked you a question! The back of the picture says Jennifer. There is no Jennifer! You thought I was stupid, didn't you, Mr. Felton? Do you... do you really think I'd come here without knowing what I'm Who talking about? Who are you, and why did you come here? Did you come to my home to threaten me with your condescending Threatening tone? you? So maybe I should ask your wife, then. She's not home. Seems like she is. Mr. Felton, I just talked to the director of the Institute on the phone. They have never heard of Dr. Reed. She is not what she claims to be. Well, Miss Reed, if that is your real name, your time here has ended. Please, leave my property. Miss Gloria will escort you out. Please follow me. Mr. Felton, please, tell me what you did to your daughter. Good evening. Follow me. You know the way. How do you even... How do I do what? How do you even sleep at night? You use people's lives regardless of the pain you cause. The Feltons have been through a lot. And they are good people. Gloria, a young girl disappeared. We all know the story, unfortunately. A burden that the Feltons will have to carry for the rest of their lives. Celeste just left them. If that was the case, there was a motivation behind it. And it threatened her life.
Ew, I don't like the way that person walks. Ooh, I'm a sneaky dude. I'm a sneaky dude. Like a rice bitch. I don't know what that's called. So I think I said like a rice bitch. I guess I just like rice a lot. Of course I would like to save my game. Look for the mirrors with the from now on you can save your game only by using those. Okay. Flash lock or Turn it off if you don't want to stick out. Remember to turn it off if you don't want to stick out. Okay. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna stop it right here. If you drop by on Mixer, then thank you for dropping by on Mixer. Uh, go ahead and leave me a follow or leave me a subscribe. That way, when I post stuff, you can just come and hang out with me. I don't really care about that many followers and stuff, but um, uh, I feel pretty cool if people could just come on and drop by. Did I just cut this off? Um, just drop by and hang out. Yeah, yeah, follow me on, if you watch it on YouTube, please subscribe to me up below and leave some comments and stuff. Uh, I probably need all the help that I can get. If you want to follow me on Instagram or anything like that, it's probably in the description below, I think, maybe. Don't take my word for it. But uh, I'm going to try to get back into doing some live streams and uh, posting stuff on YouTube and whatnot. My Instagram is ifnjax, I believe. Same thing as my mixer. My Snapchat is level underscore jax, that's J-A-C-S, so if you want to, you can follow me on there. And uh, I post all kinds of stuff. So I'm gonna try to get back into gaming and whatnot since since I can now, which is happy, which is happy for me. Alright, thank y'all for dropping by. Goodbye.